Hello everyone, I'm Sesensi here with Atlas playing more Factorio. It's sort of weird coming back to this after not having to record from the depths together. Yeah, it, it was weird. It's been a week. I've missed that sound. Oh, the robots? <laughs> yeah. I, I and the alarm been... to our voice being. a voice? Voice? Base being destroyed. Oh, I turned uh, I turned down the volume. Can't <laughs> hear them anymore. They got too annoying. Ah, oh, but you need your annoying things, Atlas. Yeah. Otherwise, then all the commenters have to uh, moan about. Exactly. Hmm. I need a. Uh, I need ammo down here and conveyor belts. I have to run up there. Well, that's your issue, isn't it? Yep, it's a, it's a personal problem. So, for anyone wondering, me and Atlas, um, we've been doing our own separate from the depths, but sort of versus series. Now, has only just started, and we're episode two now. Yep. Yeah. It's an Ash of the Empire, and basically we're racing so you can complete it the fastest. Either via in-game time or video time. Probably going to end up being in-game time because video time is going to be a pain to measure. Yeah. So how's that going for you? It's going good. Um, I did have to whip out the minigun and do a little bit of piracy. You know, ah. And just kill to kill him. So my missile volleys work extremely well because they knocked out like four of the f the six enemies like right away, but there wasn't yeah. enough of them after that. So. I f do, do, do we make a ruling on whether we're allowed to actually look at each other's videos? Um, I've kind of decided not to. Hmm. I think the viewers could tell us, get a little bit more interaction. Yeah. Honestly, I, I don't know whether at the moment I'm doing better or worse. Um, how many territories have you taken? Uh, I've taken one, but I fought two battles. Okay. So you fought more... How many crafts have you fought? Uh, four, then three. Okay. So you... Okay. I think we're about even. Hmm. I also had to fight an airship. Oh. That was a bit embarrassing. All my missiles went towards it. And they ran out of fuel just before they got there. <laughs> so it was so just so like... Oh. It's always so depressing when that happens. Just like, you missed it by how much? Also, um, I think... See, I'm not sure if it's if you'd class it as cheating, mm -hmm. but putting a solitary repair tentacle in every vehicle, like as part of the design. I mean, what would you think? Is that cheating or not? If it's a specifically designated as a support craft, then yes. Like the arrow in our last campaign it should have been mm. like that was a support craft. Like I, I made it as in it literally just has only the one. So it's not like um, the mech bull crap. Mm. They just keep preparing and you never die. Yeah. Speaking of that, the whole spin blocks on spin block thing is coming. Ooh. Uh, we need to make a stream and we need to make a, a walk-in mech. <laughs> I already have a torso. Oh, and it then just we can... It just needs legs. Could we make, like, a sea monster now? Because then you can do, like, um... You can make, like, stuff. Yeah? You can make, like... Yeah. 
I'd suspect so. You could have like a mech and a monster fighting. That'd be. Or about to Pacific Rim this. Oh, that'd be amazing. That would be amazing. Anyway, en enough about From the Depths. Yeah, we should. This is Factorio. Yeah. Okay, uh, where's the uranium deposit? I drove my tank up here. Did you mess with it? No, I haven't touched your tank. Did you park it on the railway? Oh, no. Did I? I may have. That sounds like a man who may have just lost his tank. And all that uranium. Oh. Uranium should be on the floor. I think. Um, I don't think so. I think it destroys it like a chess. I think I parked it alongside the bottom. Did I not? Wait, there's no way I could have got my tank through the solar panels, though. Speaking of solar panels, we just had a, a short, like, we didn't have enough power. Yeah. Oh, I left it at the bottom, bottom base. Okay. Remember, it's it's night time, so. It is? Oh. <laughs> Ever since night vision, I've never noticed. Yeah, it's a little hard to tell, isn't it? Although I hate I can't get enough power for all my stuff in my mag suit. Because the battery just always runs out. Hmm. It's quite annoying. Alright, I have probably 2,000 uranium here. If we can get the, um, the reactor back up and running, it'd be quite quite nice. Yeah. Is it is it a thousand uranium for the chance of one? Uh, I think it's point se like a thousand for seven. Oh. Well, no, we had like... F we had 5,200. Yeah. From our regular base. That was down here. And we had about 50. Hmm. Oh god, we have oh, we have enough stone for now. Yeah, we. Probably... I'm gonna I'm gonna move this stone brick production, so I can move the iron production down to this uh, iron belt, and just hook the iron straight up to make steel. Hmm. So it does go a little faster. I do because... have... Because... Go on. I have one more question about the From the Depths thing, and then I'll be done talking about it. Can, okay. can we think about a craft and design it in our heads before we put it in the game? Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm just... Because I was assuming, yeah, but just making sure. All right. Going in blind, that's a bad idea. Yeah, no. Though it's what we normally do. It is. So, so it doesn't deviate too much. <laughs> if it wasn't going in blind, it would be wouldn't be normal for us. You know how difficult it is to drive a tank through this base. <laughs> just, I can imagine. Just about impossible. Here, I'm gonna attempt something never done before. Ooh. <laughs> Look at that. It's cheating. Bam. Oh, yeah, I'm not getting through that. Here, maybe. Oh, yeah. Look at that. All right. That moment, Atlas just says, nope. Actually, I'm going to take the uranium, the uranium down there with me. Okay. Don't blow up your tank. Yeah, that, that would be bad. Because I wouldn't be happy with you. I wouldn't be happy with myself. Neither would the viewers, probably. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I was so good driving this tank in. I only destroyed like three things. <laughs> I think oh yeah, I only killed three things. I th and they were all light poles, so I think, I think I'm good. Oh, what are you making here? 
I'm moving the steel production down here. <sighs> I'm wondering, did you notice that? Yes. Okay. All right, make that five. Well, no, and then all the inserters <laughs> I just killed some more, like... Ten. Yeah, ten things. This is why we don't let Atlas drive. Speaking of which, I just got my driver's license like a week ago, so... R really? Yeah. How old are you? Sixteen. Wow. I think you can only... Life like a provisional in the UK at that age. Hmm. It's 15 over here for a provisional. It's called a permit, but I'm assuming it's about the same thing. Allows you to drive under supervision. Yeah. On everywhere but motorways. Oh, they should have that rule here. You call them motor motorways highways, right? Well, I mean the yeah. other way around. Yeah. The motorway is the big. Here's the max speed limit of the country. Go. You have a max speed limit of the country? Yep, 70. Hmm. That's only on motorways. I've seen some roads in Texas that are like 90. Well, Go I... to Germany. There is no speed limit. Well, on the Autobahn. Yeah. That's why I really want to go on you. <laughs> that YouTube money. Make a vlog about it. <laughs> hey, get load of load of views. Apparently, I'm here with my five pennies. I've bought a few desktop <laughs> wheels and a piece of cardboard. Uh, Here's uh, my IRL FTD tank. <laughs> <laughs> oh, speaking of which, I'm planning on getting a 3D printer, and I uh, I want to print the Fenrir. Because oh, no. I know the game is made in Unity, and I know because I program in Unity sometimes that it's made into um the type of file you can 3d print so i'm gonna have a, a finrear on my desk soon be fun uh, <laughs> we should get someone to redstone oh we should that'd be fun <laughs> um though let's not tell him about it <laughs> exactly because he would go mad he'd probably Destroy it. And load it, up, load it on YouTube for views. Well, I wouldn't blame him. No, me neither. Speaking of which, I saw him play uh, They Are Billions. Yeah, so did I. Yeah. Well, I want to try that game. I did too. They, you commented on my comment. Of course you saw it. but Yeah, it was more replying to Red. Because oh. he replied to you. I think. Yeah, he did. So I'm talking about a multiplayer version. Mm. Oh, is there a multiplayer thing of it? I'd hope so. Uh, it's still on Kickstarter, isn't it? Or um, Humble Bundle? I think. Uh... Oh, wait. Actually, it comes out tomorrow, I think. Huh. We're talking about everything but factorio right now i know oh after we're done recording this i'm buying a getting over it oh what you don't know what getting over it is no i'm disappointed what is it how do you not know so i don't know there's not a way to describe it here just after we're done look it up okay I guess. Yep. Yeah, we are really low on the old construction bots again. Yeah, it's because they slowly die off. Where's our... Do we have a robot production anywhere? Uh, We have logistics at the top left of the base. Well, the more yeah. mid left. Ah, uh, it's because they require steel, and steel is what we're having trouble with. Hmm. All right, electricity is a problem for me down here. Hang on, we haven't really sorted out the electricity problem up here. 
Well, I know. This is a separate circuit, though. I'm just manually deconstructing. <laughs> it's quicker than waiting for the droids that we are looking for. Uh, that's a funny joke. I, g I got that joke. That too. Pretty funny. Because what was the, the newest Star Wars films out, isn't it? Tomorrow, I think. I haven't seen any of the new ones yet. Mm. They're really good. I've been uh, reading tweets about them from critics, and they said there's like nothing bad with the movie. The only thing I, I, I know about them is apparently the first one they made is supposed to be a pretty much a flat copy of um, A New Hope. Mm. Oh, Rogue One, probably? No. Force Awakens. Mm. Oh, it's very similar in plot to A New Hope, Episode 4. I mean, maybe. Mm. I mean, yeah, there was a big uh, laser, and they killed it. I guess that's a, that's a conclusion. Although, I do feel like they need a, a new plot device, other than, oh, a big scary laser about to kill everyone. <laughs> like, Can we have a bigger bad guy? Or I think that's just Star Wars. But can we have something that's not like, it's, it's my boomstick, like... And then who's the stupid engineer that always engineers like a horrible thing inside of it that kills it? <laughs> hey, you gotta give the, what's it, the Death Star guys credit to be able to get the heat vent for a small space station to only two meters wide. But, if, okay, first of all, that's impossible. You can't do that. Yeah, and I, I, I just don't know why I didn't put a grate over it. I know, right? That would have stopped. That would have that fixed everything. Heck, or have two that are only a meter wide. Oh, yeah, and put them in different places. Or have, like, 50 and make them all, like, half a millimeter. With their own little turret in them. Yeah. Pew, 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 pew. And they could have made it where it wasn't just a straight hole. Like, you could have made it like a, like a funnel. Put a turn in it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're like, it has to be efficient, but very, you know. Slight bend. Yes. Just the ever so slightest of a bend, that missile would have not gotten in there. Was it a missile? Okay. Or was it like a plasma thing? Yeah, it was a mi missile. Uh, okay, my emperor, we have fixed the problem with the first Death Star. Oh, yeah? Yeah, the vent that that missile went down is gone. Oh, great. Well, what's there now? Well, it's an even larger vent that can fit an entire <laughs> ship down it. I saw that video. Yeah, it, it was just like, fair point. Yeah. That's pretty much what happened. At least, at least the Force Awakens one didn't have an air vent. But they still had to go, like, across a trench to attack a thing. Yeah. They they had to blow up the thermal thing, which is still... Th Knock out the shield generator. On every poster, they should just put, like, th like the three laws of thermodynamics and go, like, the biggest enemy. Because that's, <laughs> that's it. That's the whole reason the Empire has failed. It's because their boom laser didn't have... A and have proper cooling. So what destroyed your giant space station? Some kid who's learning space magic. Because <laughs> that's what it is. Space magic. Now before anyone gets annoyed, we both love Star Wars. Yes. I'm just... We like poking fun at it. Yeah. Well, it's... 
everything we like making fun of, but you know. I mean, I'm British, so I make fun of myself on a daily basis. That moment when all your construction robots have zero energy. Oh. And they're charging, trying to charge off your robo port, personal robo port that has zero energy. So <sighs> it's following me like a stalker, about as slow as it can. Ah, okay. So our power situation is slowly getting better. Good. We should have some uranium soonish. Either way, we should soon not even need that. I'm hoping. Well, the nuclear reactor is good because it's efficient and the, the resources that it takes. It's just a fact of finding the resource. Yeah, there is that. Can we please get a converter from 238 to um, uranium ore? No, we don't have the... Well, let's get the science. What what do no. I need to do to be able Look, to get we the don't science? Even, no, we don't even have the purple science set up. Okay, so that's the main objective. We need, we need purple science. And then we need gold science. So let's work on purple science. Where's my tank? Tank, where'd you go? Did my tank just straight up disappear? Again? My tank disappeared. Do I have like amnesia or something? I can't. Did I pick it up maybe? Oh yeah, it's in my inventory. Who stole my tank? <laughs> A mini series by Atlas. Ha has mini jean pockets, fits entire tank, 164 explosive missiles. And about 2,000 conveyor belts into pockets. <laughs> ah, video games. Don't ever change. Do I have, like, a black hole in my pocket? And it's, yes. You're, you're limiting yourself? Alright, I'm gonna have to burn some electric fuel lines. I mean, um... Some pylon poles. To get Not the pylon poles. I need... I require more pylons. You what? require additional pylons. Oh, yeah, that's the meme. I forgot. Ah, uh, StarCraft. You must construct, Mom. Everything. What? You need everything. Why are oh. Blizzard games always, like, the, the most... Have, the, like, the hardcore fans? I don't know. Like, I played World of Warcraft, like, a month ago. It's, it's not fun anymore. Oh, when do classic servers come out? I think probably just before Battle for Azeroth. Uh, so, I hope they have uh, Continental. I, I, I still find it fun. But you do? I just don't have that same... Oh, yeah. I'm only going to get to play it for the weekend kind of mentality hmm. that I had back when I was nine. Oh, well, yeah, when you're when you're younger, it's just like you have all the time in the world. And that is like the perfect game just to like satisfy your young mind of running around doing stuff. Yeah, trying to get to level 40 to get your first mount. It's level zero nowadays, baby. <laughs> Pretty much. No, really, the heirloom. If you get enough heirlooms, like I. Like oh I yeah, do, there's there's an heirloom mount, isn't there? Yeah, level zero. It's just like, ah, oh, for God's sake. There's no more challenge in the game anymore. Well, there there is. It's just. Yeah, but it's all higher know, content know, and stuff. I know why it's there though, because they like, okay, that's why I like the leveling revamp they're doing. Yeah. Because it will slow down the leveling experience enough to where and make it enough for challenge, but it's still going to be, I reckon, probably a little faster than. 
it'll probably Vanilla? feel mentally slower, but in the actuality, it'll be faster. Well, it, it, it just means you won't be able to pull, like... The good thing a is you can finally full of mobs. Well, yeah, you can finally experience like the content and stuff. It's not like um. Yeah, you actually get to experience the leveling zone, which really helps newer players. Yeah, like people who have just picked up WoW for the first time. God help you. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> were you born three years ago? Okay, and that's the uh, twenty-five minute mark. So, uh, yes. We rambled about stuff that wasn't even this game, and even when we tried to do this game, we didn't get much done. No. But Isn't I think that... that's more about what, you know, Let's Plays are supposed to be. Yeah. I think. For a long time, I've tried to be like like the like the, the spastic the, the spastic one. I finally just like... Ooh. That's... What? what? Careful with that word. People S might find it offensive. Spastic? Yes. How? Oh, does it have like a different relative meaning over there? Yeah, I think... I think it's something to do with like being mentally challenged. Oh, that's... From my experience, that's not what this means. Okay, whatever. Just like freaky? Not No, that'd be... Okay, whatever. Anyway, yeah. It's we, better to be we, calm we, and just, just talk. We're now not advertiser-friendly. I know. They're, all those three cents and that Big Mac just down the drain. That's... Oh, I could go for a Big Mac. Though I don't really eat McDonald's. So... With the revenue I've made this week, I could buy uh, a Big Mac and a Coke. I could feed myself from one night. Cut it into four. Ration it. I'd become uh, the Martian guy. The movie. Did you watch that? I haven't watched it, no. Uh, he got so thin, eating like half a potato a day. <laughs> anyway, thank you all for watching. Yeah, so if you've liked them, please consider liking. If you want to subscribe to me or Atlas, then please consider hitting that subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be alerted to when our next FTD ramble. Ramble? On a Factorio video. Yes, there you go. I was bringing it back around. Um, yeah. I completely lost my train of thought from that. But yes, when our next videos come up from either series. I'm I'm slowly killing his brain cells. Just ever yeah. so slowly killing his brain cells. And all that good stuff. So yeah. See you all next time. Goodbye. Bye.